everybody, hope you had a great weekend. We're honored to be the recipient of a grant from the Miami Valley Regional Planning Commission for three vehicles for our non-medical transportation program. This will allow us to expand our services and provide transportation to more of our clients. We also received a generous donation from someone in the community of Men's XXL Clothing. The clothing is very nice and it's available to any of the clients that we serve. If you're interested in seeing the clothing or want to pick some of it up, contact Larissa Ingram. You have to check out a new video recognizing the partnership that we have with My Change Purposes and Artemis Center. It's been a great relationship and opportunity for the individuals at our day program. I want to give a special thank you to Larissa for making sure that our individuals are connected to the community. Here at Toward Independence, we have a development fund where all of the donations we receive go directly to the individuals that we support. Alma recently started taking art classes and she's really loving it. She's even going to be submitting some of her artwork in the Art and Soul exhibit coming soon. If you know someone who has a need or something that they would like to experience, please contact John Silphies at the email on the screen. Art and Soul showcases the artistic talents of people with developmental disabilities. If you know someone who would like to enter their art into Art and Soul, make sure that they go to the website on the screen. JFS has recently sent out some letters to some of our homes with instructions on choosing my plan. Make sure you check with your doctors that they accept the plan and you have to make a selection by the deadline. This week's shout out goes to Joe Vetter, our Q down in Cincinnati. He's taken on a lot of challenges, especially with some of the individuals with behaviors. He's really kept the home together. He continues to make a positive impact on everyone around him. Thank you, Joe, for all of your hard work and for being a great example of what we do here at Tour de Independence. On behalf of everybody here at Tour de Independence, we want to wish you a very Merry Christmas and special thanks to those that are working on Christmas Day to support our individuals. Make it a great week.